Technician Class Question Pool. Questions and Correct Answers, only July 1, 2018 to June 30, 2022. By K.A.T.V. Last edited August 12, 2018. Subelement T1. FCC Rules, Descriptions, and Definitions for the Amateur Radio Service. Operator and Station License Responsibilities 6 Exam Questions, 6 Groups. Which of the following is a purpose of the amateur radio service as stated in the FCC rules and regulations? Answer, advancing skills in the technical and communication phases of the radio art. Which agency regulates and enforces the rules for the amateur radio service in the United States? Answer, the FCC. What are the FCC rules regarding the use of a phonetic alphabet for station identification in the amateur radio service? Answer, it is encouraged. How many operator slash primary station license grants may be held by any one person? Answer, 1. What is proof of possession of an FCC-issued operator slash primary license grant? Answer, the control operator's operator slash primary station license must appear in the FCC ULS consolidated licensee database. What is the FCC Part 97 definition of a beacon? Answer, an amateur station transmitting communications for the purposes of observing propagation or related experimental activities. What is the FCC Part 97 definition of a space station? Answer, an amateur station located more than 50 kilometers above the Earth's surface. Which of the following entities recommends transmit slash receive channels and other parameters for auxiliary and repeater stations? Answer, volunteer frequency coordinator recognized by local amateurs. Who selects a frequency coordinator? Answer, amateur operators in a local or regional area whose stations are eligible to be repeater or auxiliary stations. Which of the following describes the radio amateur civil emergency service races? Answer, answer. All of these choices are correct. A radio service using amateur frequencies for emergency management or civil defense communications. A radio service using amateur stations for emergency management or civil defense communications. An emergency service using amateur operators certified by a civil defense organization as being enrolled in that organization. When is willful interference to other amateur radio stations permitted? Answer, at no time. What is the International Telecommunications Union, ITU? Answer, a United Nations Agency for Information and Communication Technology Issues. Which amateur radio stations may make contact with an amateur radio station on the International Space Station, ISS, using 2 meter and 70 centimeters band frequencies? Answer, any amateur holding a technician or higher class license. Which frequency is within the 6 meter amateur band? Answer, 52.525 MHz. Which amateur band are using when your station is transmitting on 146.52 MHz? Answer, 2 meter band. What is the limitation for emissions on the frequencies between 219 and 220 MHz? Answer, fixed digital message forwarding systems only. On which HF bands does a technician class operator have phone privileges? Answer, 10 meter band only. Which of the following VHF slash UHF frequency ranges are limited to CW only? Answer, 50.0 MHz to 50.1 MHz and 144.0 MHz to 144.1 MHz. Which of the following is a result of the fact that the amateur radio service is secondary in all or portions of some amateur bands, such as portions of the 70 cm band? Answer, U.S. amateurs may find non-amateur stations in those portions and must avoid interfering with them. Why should you not set your transmit frequency to be exactly at the edge of an amateur band or sub-band? Answer, all of these choices are correct. To allow for calibration error in the transmitter frequency display. So that modulation sidebands do not extend beyond the band edge. To allow for transmitter frequency drift. Which of the following HF bands have frequencies available to the technician class operator? operator for RTTY and data transmissions? Answer, 10 meter band only. What is the maximum peak envelope power output for technician class operators using their assigned portions of the HF bands? Answer, 200 watts. Except for some specific restrictions, what is the maximum peak envelope power output for technician class operators using frequencies above 30 megahertz? Answer, 1500 watts. For which license classes are new licenses currently available from the FCC? 
Answer, technician, general, amateur extra. Who may select a desired call sign under the vanity call sign rules? Answer, any licensed amateur. What types of international communications is an FCC licensed amateur radio station permitted to make? Answer, communications incidental to the purposes of the amateur radio service and remarks of a personal character. When are you allowed to operate your amateur station in a foreign country? Answer, when the foreign country authorizes it. Which of the following is a valid call sign for a technician class amateur radio station? Answer, k one triple x From which of the following locations may an FCC licensed amateur station transmit? Answer, from any vessel or craft located in international waters and documented or registered in the United States. What may result when correspondence from the FCC is returned as undeliverable because the grantee failed to provide and maintain a correct mailing address with the FCC? Answer, revocation of the station license or suspension of the operator license. What is the normal term for an FCC-issued primary station slash operator amateur radio license grant? Answer, 10 years. What is the grace period following the expiration of an amateur license within which the license may be renewed? Answer, two years. How soon after passing the examination for your first amateur radio license may you operate a, a transmitter on an amateur radio service frequency? Answer, as soon as your operator slash station license grant appears in the FCC's license database. If your license has expired and is still within the allowable grace period, may you continue to operate a transmitter on amateur radio service frequencies? Answer, no. Transmitting is not allowed until the FCC license database shows that the license has been renewed. With which countries are FCC licensed amateur radio stations prohibited from exchanging communications? Answer, any country whose administration has notified the International Telecommunications Union, ITU, that it objects to such communications. Under which of the following circumstances may an amateur radio station make one-way transmissions? Answer, when transmitting code practice, information bulletins, or transmissions necessary to provide emergency communications. When is it permissible to transmit messages encoded to hide their meaning? Answer, only when transmitting control commands to space stations or radio control craft. Under what conditions is an amateur station authorized to transmit music using a phone emission? Answer, when incidental to an authorized retransmission of manned spacecraft communications. When may amateur radio operators use their stations to notify other amateurs of the availability of equipment for sale or trade? Answer, when the equipment is normally used in an amateur station and such activity is not conducted on a regular basis. What, if any, are the restrictions concerning transmission of language that may be considered indecent or obscene? Answer, any such language is prohibited. What types of amateur stations can automatically retransmit the signals of other amateur stations? Answer repeater, auxiliary, or space stations. In which of the following circumstances may the control operator of an amateur station receive compensation for operating that station? Answer, when the communication is incidental to classroom instruction at an educational institution. Under which of the following circumstances are amateur stations authorized to transmit signals related to broadcasting, program production, or news gathering, assuming no other means is available? Answer, only where such communications directly relate to the immediate safety of human life or protection of property. What is the meaning of the term broadcasting in the FCC rules for the amateur radio? Service? Answer, transmissions intended for reception by the general public. When may an amateur station transmit without on-the-air identification? Answer, when transmitting signals to control model craft. When is an amateur station permitted to transmit without a control operator? Answer. Never. Who may be the control operator of a station communicating through an amateur satellite or space station? Answer, any amateur whose license privileges allow them to transmit on the satellite uplink frequency. Who must designate the station control operator? Answer, the station licensee. What determines the transmitting privileges of an amateur station? Answer, the class of operator license held by the control operator. What is an amateur station control point? Answer, the location at which the control operator function is performed. When, under normal circumstances, may a technician class licensee be the control operator of a station operating in an exclusive amateur extra class operator segment of the amateur bands? Answer, at no time. 
when the control operator is not the station licensee, who is responsible for the proper operation of the station. Answer, the control operator and the station licensee are equally responsible. Which of the following is an example of automatic control? Answer, repeater operation. Which of the following is true of remote control operation? Answer, answer all of these choices are correct. The control operator must be at the control point. A control operator is required at all times. The control operator indirectly manipulates the controls. Which of the following is an example of remote control as defined in part 97? Answer, operating the station over the internet. Who does the FCC presume to be the control operator of an amateur station, unless documentation to the contrary is in the station records? Answer, the station licensee. When must the station licensee make the station and its records available for FCC inspection? Answer, at any time, upon request by an FCC representative. When using tactical identifiers such as race headquarters during a community service net operation, how often must your station transmit the station's FCC assigned call sign? Answer, at the end of each communication and every 10 minutes during a communication. When is an amateur station required to transmit its assigned call sign? Answer, at least every 10 minutes during and at the end of a communication. Which of the following is an acceptable language to use for station identification when operating in a phone subband? Answer, the English language. What method of call sign identification is required for a station transmitting phone signals? Answer, send the call sign using a CW or phone emission. Which of the following formats of a self-assigned indicator is acceptable when identifying using a phone transmission? Answer, all of these choices are correct. KL7CC stroke W3. KL7CC slant W3. KL7CC slash W3. Which of the following restrictions apply when an unlicensed person is allowed to speak to a foreign station using a station under the control of a technician class control operator? Answer, the foreign station must be one with which the U.S. has a third-party agreement. What is meant by the term third-party communications? Answer, a message from a control operator to another amateur station control operator on behalf of another person. What type of amateur station simultaneously retransmits the signal of another amateur station on a different channel or channels? Answer, repeater station. Who is accountable should a repeater inadvertently retransmit communications that violate the FCC rules? Answer, the control operator of the originating station. Which of the following is a requirement for the issuance of a club station license grant? Answer, the club must have at least four members. This is the end of the sub-element one of the technician question pool.